Sorry, Mr. Galloway? You said we. Are you an Israeli? I am, yes. I don't debate with Israelis. I've been misled. Sorry. What? what? Racism? What? I, don't, Racism? I don't recognize Israel and I don't debate with Israelis. are trying to figure out who spray-painted swastikas all over the Jewish fraternity on Emory's campus. Yale University, three swastikas were drawn outside a freshman dorm. University of New Mexico police are trying to find out who scratched a swastika onto a Jewish student's dorm room door. F*** you Zionist scums. uncomfortable in their own living situation. Students are definitely intimidated. A lot of the pro-Palestinian students were screaming and just very offensive towards the pro-Israel students who spoke at the meeting. Pro-Israel students faced threats. Students were also called dirty Jews, things like this. Especially those on central student government were called on the phone saying, we know where you live, like vote with us or else. All of these disparaging insults, accompanied by threats of violence, messages that I and other members of central student government have been receiving this past week. To say that this is a non-violent, peaceful movement, I would seriously disagree, especially with the number of emails and harassing texts and harassing voicemails and harassing calls that have caused me to miss class for a week. who spent much of his life speaking Hebrew. I'm horrid! Propagating yeah. murder is not an expression of free speech! Shut up! A number of pro-Israel students have events. Students for Justice in Palestine will literally shout down the speaker. This is not an example of free speech! They will stage a walkout, in some cases even curse at the speaker. They're notorious for doing this. My only purpose today is that this event is shut down. Not a Darwin speech for Israeli apartheid! This exclusionary position is designed to create such pressure that this nation will feel itself totally isolated, a pariah. A lot of anti-Semitism is exactly about that. The long history of anti-Semitism is full of such exclusionary measures, full of boycotts, which has been a chosen weapon of anti-Semites through the centuries. But the Nazis moved slowly against the Jews. The first official action came in April 1933, when propaganda minister Joseph Goebbels ordered a nationwide boycott of Jewish businesses. I'm a Jew. The head of Hezbollah has said that he hopes that we will gather in Israel so he doesn't have to hunt us down globally. For it or against it? For it. <laughs>